Hey, I'm Troubleshoot. In this quick video, I'll show you how to use voice chat in Grey Zone Warfare. So, unfortunately, at the time of recording, there is no way to change the push to talk button that's set by default in game. And on top of this, we'll pause the game, head across to options in the top right, followed by controls. In here, it doesn't seem to say anything about the voice key either. The voice key that you're looking for is Z, usually in the bottom left of your keyboard, relatively easy to get to on QWERTY keyboards, etc. This is simple enough. Simply run around the game holding Z and you should be able to speak to people. However, if you encounter any issues, head across to this options menu, so escape, options in the top right, and on the game tab, just under audio, you'll be able to adjust your audio settings over here. First of all, you'll want to make sure that proximity VoIP is enabled and squad VoIP. However, you can disable either one of these if you so need it. If you're playing with friends and you don't want people in the area to hear you, you can turn off proximity VoIP and only your squad should be able to hear you and vice versa. If you want to hear proximity chat, turn this on and you'll hear people nearby you. However, if you're a streamer or something like that and worried about people spamming you, shouting profanities, then this is something you'll want to turn off and keep only your squad VoIP enabled. Of course, if you're not using something like this, Discord anyways. So for most people, pressing Z is good enough. You'll be able to speak to your team and that's that. However, if for some reason your voice chat isn't working, how exactly do we go ahead and fix it? Well, having a look here, there's only an option to change the default output device as in where all the audio, including your voice chat goes to. How do you change your input device? Well, first of all, you'll need to double check your settings in Windows. So go ahead, right click your sound icon in the bottom right and open sound settings or something like that. You'll either be taken across to a window like this on Windows 11, for example, you just make a better background. There we go. So something like this on Windows 11 or new versions of Windows 10. And in here, all you need to do is scroll down a little bit to input and make sure that you have the correct microphone ticked here. So the one that I currently have ticked is my camera. It's not what I want. I'll tick analog one too. And what I do some is should hopefully be updated in game. And when I speak, people can hear what I'm saying. If you're on Windows 10 or an older version of Windows 11, etc., and you don't see this window, you'll likely see this legacy window over here. Head across to the recording tab of the sound panel here. Simply locate your microphone, right click it and choose set as default communication device. And on top of this, set as default device. Once you set both of these, you've practically done the same thing as we just did in the Windows 11 control panel. And when you tap back into game, you should hopefully be able to speak to other people. Currently at the time of recording, there's no way of knowing when you're actually speaking to other people or broadcasting any sound as when you hold Z, there's not even an icon to say that you're speaking but obviously just saying can you hear me and someone nearby you is bound to respond even if it's in a different language however if things still aren't working make sure you hit shift tab to bring up this screen over here or this screen rather simply click settings at the very bottom here then voice on the far left and simply make sure that your voice input device is correct here then you can go ahead and test your sound using the start microphone test here and you'll be able to hear yourself speaking and of course any birds outside that are making a lot of noise with that once you've done all of this you should be able to speak in game i doubt you need to restart your game completely after adjusting these settings but if you're still having difficulties that's the last thing i would try now just a quick note if you are on windows 11 and you're running with pretty much stock settings out of the box you may not actually be allowing programs like gray zone warfare to use your microphone obviously we have having issues in Steam and elsewhere, but in order to fix that issue, open up your settings once more, head across to privacy and security, then scrolling down all the way to microphone under app permissions. Make sure that you have microphone access ticked. Make sure that you have let apps access your microphone ticked as well and scroll down until you see let desktop apps access your microphone. Make sure that this is on as well. After you have all three of these ticked and you get back to your game, you try to speak, you'll likely see it pop up on the list here. And as you can see, Grey's and Warfare currently in use is currently using or at least has access to my microphone and is listening. My much like OBS, for example. Anyways, with that, you now know how to fix any microphone issues that you could come across in Grey Zone Warfare, and things should hopefully be working just fine for you. So, thank you all for watching. My name's been Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!